An Australian tree that is the source of a cancer cure has been taken off the market out of fears people could be poisoned using it at home. The blushwood tree, Fontaineur picrosperma, contains a chemical compound in its seeds which research firm QBiotics has developed into the anti-cancer drug EBC46. In human clinical trials of the cancer treatment, it successfully treated four different types of tumours melanoma, squamous cell carcinoma, basal cell carcinoma, and breast adenocarcinoma. Here is the report from Channel 7 News in Australia. The words cure and cancer don't often go together, but a single injection of a berry found only in Australia's far north is now thought to cure many types of cancer. It's been tested on animals at death's door and now on humans, making tumours disappear in just 48 hours. In the depths of the Queensland rainforest grows a small seed with huge potential. This is an extraordinary drug, it's a unique drug and it really is something quite different. Derived only from Australia's blushwood tree, EBC46 is a molecule that can fight cancer. A full tumour destruction within seven days. Following astonishing results shrinking solid tumours in animals like Oscar, world first human trials have now begun. For melanoma sufferer Denise Powell, joining the trial was a chance to avoid amputation. My cancer surgeon said, I can take that one out. If you get any more, then you might lose an arm. Instead of more surgery, EBC46 was injected directly into the tumour in Denise's armpit. Less than 20 minutes, the tumour had gone purple, then black. Then within a couple of days, the tumour just kind of shriveled up and died. This first stage trial is using safe, low doses, but even early results look promising. Surgery treats most tumours, about 60% of them worldwide, and to do that you need an operating theatre, but with EBC46 you could go along anywhere. When injected, EBC46 triggers an immune response, activating white blood cells to attack the tumour and shrinking it to nothing. So far, the treatment targets solid tumours such as melanomas and cancers of the head, neck and breast cancer. If this rainforest remedy is found to be safe and effective in humans, it could offer a whole new treatment option for cancer patients, especially the elderly, who can't face another round of chemo or go back under the knife. The second, larger phase of the trial begins next year. Dr Andrew Rochford, 7 News.